some of the best wheels ever made if you're a triathlete if you're a lightweight rider if you want something top tier um second hand get something like these near new this is called the dt swiss monchasseral incredible wheel set rim brake only all right rim brake only we're talking road bikes here road performance you don't need disc brakes in a road bike you don't need disc brakes in a triathlon all right you just don't if you do get some skills uh, otherwise you're gonna be dangerous out there these are incredible rims uh, we, compared to the Windspace Hypers, the Windspace Hypers are better general as an all-round wheel, but these are going to be a bit better if you're a triathlete. Uh, if you're a triathlete, these just accelerate so good through the corners, uh, climbing time trials, they're just incredible. The wind stability and crosswinds are amazing because they're so shallow. The deeper the wheel, the more sketchy it's going to be in windy conditions. So if you're out there doing uh, you know, Hawaii Ironman Kona and you've got blustery crosswinds and you've got a deep section wheel, you're not going to enjoy that. That's going to be you know, quite a lot slower and more dangerous. So yeah, for real world, for real world road conditions, these are great. And we're going to go to the next wheel set. This best all round. Space Hyper, and I, I rate it as the best carbon wheel set ever made. Rim brake. Why is that? The braking surface, unrivaled. It's incredible braking surface. The strength. I've hit big rocks on this. I've done gravel riding. Pounded these rims to see how strong they are. Downstairs gutters. Super strong rim. The DT Swiss better for a 50 kilo, 60 kilo rider, but who's 50, 60 kilos? Not many of us, um, unless we're you know doing my protocols without the full netty bra. But these are these are, these, these are the best all-round carbon wheel set ever made. I've ridden them all, you know, lightweight MD zips. The hubs are great on these. The spokes are strong. They're just legit. If you want a set, just watch my videos. Watch my videos. Use, use the code during ten ten percent off. Wind space hyper braking service. Man, when I use these, I'm like, why why are you using disc brakes? Use this, man. You know, disc brakes on a road bike with a, a road race 25mm tyre, 100 psi. Like road race tyres at road race psi, disc brakes. That's dangerous, man. That's stupid. What are you doing? Look at the crashes now. Look at NorCal. Look, look what happened to NorCal. Deal, if you want the best wheels, I've got the best advice. I've got, I, don't know, I don't know how many wheels I've got at home. Like 40, 50 pairs of wheels, high end carbon, I've got Mavics, I've got the, everything. I've tested them all. Natasha's in the wheel swap now. DT Swiss Monchasserau, my favourite wheel set for like a Strava Com. But for everyday riding, you know, racing, everything, durability, wind space hyper, can't go past the braking surface. It's like, man, the DT Swiss, the braking surface is very, very poor. Um, but I don't really mind it, you know, I don't really mind it. Um, you get used to it, as long as you've got good pads. But the, the, the where are we with the hand? The hypers just have that, you know, it's almost too it's almost too powerful braking on the hypers like it's it's so grippy for me um, but on the road bike when you've got skinny tires you don't need very powerful brakes because you can lock up the tire too easy i run 100 120 psi because i'm going for yeah, performance and you know i hate getting dropped so i run higher pressures but if you're you know gravel riding from gravel riding it's 30 40 psi disc brakes 40 mil rubber it's a lot different so that's yeah we go there on natasha's how you going over there natasha getting that mechanical skill going there a bit of big roll here. So yeah, that's what I mean, you know, and always get the, the girls, or well, not the girls, always get the person who doesn't have the skill set to do the job so they can build the skill set. If you always do everything for them, you know, if people, that's how I learned. You know, people wouldn't always do things to me, so I'm, I've got to learn how to do this myself. Um, and you supervise, you make sure the job's done right. And I always give praise and it's good to go. We're up here at Norton Summit, with old mate Tom behind us, the Sunnies, whoever put the Sunnies on Tom. we like, that's your sense of humour. All good, Natasha? There's one problem though, because my bike doesn't have a wheel on it. Am I walking back? <laughs> well, I'm going to have to do a mono down the hill. Yeah. Natasha thinks that's pretty funny. I don't. I think that's funny at all.